Hi guys and welcome to my storage. Well, actually it's uh, my storage in Turkey in Bodrum uh, at my windsurfing center. I only brought the kit here that I was going to use uh, during this trip. Uh, I've been here now almost one month and yeah, I was mainly wanting to foil train and then I still have a um, few toys here that uh, I hadn't taken with me. So uh, let me give you a little tour of what I have here at the moment. So this is my trusted uh, freestyle board. <laughs> it's a few years old by now, but uh, still works amazing. And since I don't use it that much, it's uh, still as good as new. Uh, then we have the brand new foil slalom 81. Uh, I just started using this board now here. I've been out a few times. As you know, we're going to be doing foil slalom on the PWA and light winds from now on. And yeah, it's a uh, gonna be my light wind weapon of choice on the PWA tour. Then in the back here's another one of my all-time favorite toys, uh, a starboard sub. Well it's a wave sub. You see right we don't have that many waves in Turkey so uh, I'm still waiting for the moment that I find a good storm and get to ride this in some waves here in Turkey. One eye is always on the forecast when I'm here, but at the moment I have not been lucky so far. Then here center stage, obviously my uh, trusted IQ foil board. It's so huge and right now I've got the foil on it, so uh, I can't put it in the rack. And then in the back here, I have a couple of wave sails for this little baby over here, my Code 76. I also brought this with me on this trip here because uh, I'm hoping that we'll catch uh, some winter onshore storms and that we get some fun little ramps to do some jumps or yeah. Let's see, T actually tomorrow looks windy so I better put some fins on this one. And here I've my got so my two wave sails, 3.7 and 4.5. They're the two sizes I think that will cover me in a big range of wind. And finally, this one is a, actually a very special board. <laughs> I'm not sure if you can recognize it, but the Sonic is still there. It's also got actually a very special story, this board, because uh, this is actually my very first slalom board and I only got it because I think I was like 12 or something and uh, I was starting to try to jibe and like starting to go faster and one guy in the windsurfing center um, I was staying bought this board and he let me use it so I went across the bay and I was going fast and trying to jibe and like I didn't look around me and then chat crash <laughs> someone crashed into me Basically the fin went, I don't remember where, somewhere here, completely into the board and yeah, what happened is that uh, my dear parents were forced to buy this board for me and buy a new one for the guy that lent it to me. And that's how I started uh, slalom sailing with Isonic boards and uh, yeah, the rest is history now. <laughs> Here are my booms, um, my R360 booms, my IQ foil booms, my IQ foil sail mast, my slalom sail. I just brought the 7.8. Like I said, I only wanted to train foil slalom here or IQ foil when it's windier. Or maybe if we get some onshore storms, then wave riding, wetsuits. And uh, yeah, basically that's my uh, capsule wardrobe, as you might call it that I have here in Bodrum at the moment and uh, of course we're missing all the slalom stuff but um, yeah that will be for after new year I get back on the slalom stuff so um, yeah no win today but tomorrow <laughs> <laughs>